I get really tired of these rumors that people have on me <clears throat> and on negativity. So let me just clear the air once and for all. It's probably not going to be once and for all, but I'm going to do it now. Number one, I am not Illuminati. I don't know how to spell Illuminati. I've never met anybody in Illuminati. They've never come to me and offered me anything. Um, plus, you know, uh, I love Jesus too much, so they probably wouldn't accept me anyway. Number two, I'm not pro-choice, <clears throat> but I am more than pro-life. I'm whole life from the womb to the tomb, the whole person, the whole community, the whole environment. I did not campaign for any politician. I did show up to rap at an event. I thought it was bipartisan. It was a vote early thing and it wasn't, but it doesn't mean I'm campaigning for any politician. I am not a carnal Christian. Uh, I have been before, but you wouldn't have known about it. Um, but uh, I am sincerely passionate about Jesus. I did not leave the church for the money. Some people think I left and went to go be mainstream because it paid more. It doesn't. It doesn't pay more. I actually had to pay money to do mainstream shows, but that to me was missionary work. It's actually more financially beneficial to pretend you love God and show up at all the good Christian events and not to stir up trouble. I keep stirring up trouble, which should let you know I'm not concerned with the money because I've messed up money plenty of times by just keeping it 1000. I am not trying to use my faith as a tool to get ahead in this world. Um, end of the day, I love Jesus. He saved my life at 19 years old. And uh, since then, I've been passionate for him. It hasn't been an easy road, but it's been a fulfilling road. Lastly, I got nothing to hide. Nothing. No double lifestyle. Uh, I have a community group. I have a wife. I have a therapist. They know all of my dirt. And um, that's the way it should be, you know, um, confession leads to healing, you know.